Carl Zeiss is a German company. We are in India from last 40 years. We have been in the business of coordinate machining machines. Further to that, we have also broadened our spectrum and we have started offering automation solutions to the industry. The division which offers all these solutions is called IQS, which means industrial quality solutions. Earlier, we used to have loading systems. Loading systems are quite cumbersome. It was not flexible. When you want to change the product line, it used to create more problems. Now, with the introduction of cobots from UR, which we are using over here, cobots gives the flexibility to integrate many machines. Earlier, there was only one operator who was responsible for one machine. And what you see over here, we see three machines being integrated with a cobot. That automatically gives me flexibility, higher productivity, and 24 bar 7 operations. We have brought the automation technology in metrology. So here we have three technologies, that is CMM, contour machines, and non-contact measuring machines. All these three measuring machines have been integrated with the help of the universal robot. We have like different variety of parts, uh, the turned parts and the stamp parts. So based on the barcode, the robot will pick up the job, it puts into the particular machine and the program is selected. And once the inspection is finished, the measuring machines will send the information to the robot saying which part is okay, not okay. Then the robot will pick the part from that measuring machine and it puts okay part in the okay bin and not okay parts in the not okay bin. If you have a productivity of 50% with an operator, but when you are integrating that with a robot, you can expect more than 90% utilization with the machines. And this gives a neat and flexible system which can be adapted maybe in a day or two for the new system. I think that is where we have to be looking at cobots being applied to automation. The future is great. And when we are looking at 24 bar 7, the only solutions what we have is with the cobots.